In today's video, I'm going to show you how to use the map function in Google Sheets. Now, the map function is a great helper function to our Lambda function. And what it does, it, it helps distribute the formula expression within the Lambda function to each cell in your selected range or arrays. So let's say in this range right here, I want to deduct one from each number. And I'm going to do that with this function. Let's get started. Start with your equal sign. We have our formula suggested right there, but we're not going to use that. So select map right here or type it in. Then select your array or your range. We're just going to have one right here, comma, and let's go to our Lambda function. Now here in the Lambda function, we're going to create our own formula expression. So again, what I'm going to do is to deduct one from each number. But before I do that, I'm going to name this array first. So I'm just going to call them numbers comma now you can't actually use numbers to name your arrays because this formula will not work so we're going to stick with text or letters after the name we're going to go to our formula expression which would be numbers minus one and close off that formula press enter and there you have it our output array will also be equal to our selected array so 1 minus 1 is 0, 2 minus 1 is 1, 3 minus 1 is 2, and so on. So you get the idea. The map function distributes the formula expression throughout the selected range. Let's try another example right here. We have our data set where we want to calculate for the total purchase by creating our own formula of multiplying the quantity to our price to get the total purchase. So we're going to use the map function for that. Start with map, select your array. We have two arrays right here, one comma, the second right here, comma. Now we're going to our Lambda function now. And now we're gonna name those two arrays. So the first one would be quantity, comma, price. Now you can make this shorter, it's totally up to you. I just want to point out what these are pertaining to so the quantity is this first array right here and the price would be our second array right here and now for a formula expression which would be quantity multiplied by our price to get our total purchase and if you press enter we have calculated the total purchase for our entire array without dragging down a formula because again we have already selected that and now it has distributed a formula expression to each selected array. And that's just one of the many ways on how to use the map function here in Google Sheets. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, do leave a like and subscribe for more helpful videos. See you on the next one.